my name's Phil. Today we're going to be installing a warm-up cable system. We're going to be using our edge strip kits as a self-leveling compound to encapsulate the wire um, to protect it during the tile stage. It's a good idea to prime the subfloor if you're using, in this case we're using Hardy Backer, or if you're using a uh, CBU or any other cement board. Again, the perimeter strips cut as simple with a utility knife. Our instrument kits are allowed to go right over the register. This will make sure that the self leveler doesn't go in it. We, once it's dry, we can easily cut it out with a utility knife. We use an extra kit right here at the door threshold um, that will make sure that the self leveler is contained inside our tiled area and not be allowed to spill over onto our strip up. We can actually also use the strips to go around our toilet collar too to again make sure that the self leveler does not go down any holes. The warm up heater um, spacing that we're going to use is actually 2 inch spacing. Extra kits come 2 inches. So what we're going to do is we'll just actually even use the strip to draw our lines and that's what we'll use to follow um, when we install our cable. Our electrician was good enough to give us two conduit leads down here so what we'll do is one will be for our cold lead for our heater and then the second one will be for our sensor for our thermostat. Okay, starting by with the cold lead here, we're going to take some small pieces of tape and just temporarily tape down the wire so that we can adjust it if we need to. And then after the end, we're actually going to totally cover the wire up with the tape to embed it and keep it tight to the substrate. Okay, we've stretched out our heater element and we've got full coverage, nice coverage around the toilet here. Our next step is to actually take the tape that's provided and actually seal down each of the strips before we pour ourselves a little If you have any um, questions whatsoever about the installation of the warm-up product, make sure that you check back with the owner's manual. Next step is we cut a channel here in our edge strip kits and um, for our sensor wire, we're going to run it in between a loop of our heater wire. Make sure that you don't cross it and so that it doesn't touch it. Out somewhere into the middle of the room just so that it's not near a window or maybe even the heat so it might get a false reading. Okay, now we're ready to actually pour our self leveler. We're using Superior's Pro Level that's available at the tile shop. So it's a matter of mixing it as per the instructions. Take your time and allow the self leveler to go up to the edge strip kits. Okay, we're here at the second day. Our self leveler is completely dry, nice hard surface, completely flush with our edge strip kits, and our wire is completely encapsulated. There's no possible damage that can be done during our tile installation. This is actually the best way to be installed on any floor heating systems. We want to thank our friends at Warmup for supplying our floor heating system. If you have any questions whatsoever about the edge strip kits, make sure that you contact me personally. It's phil at edstripkits.com. I'll be happy to answer any of your questions. The kits are available at www.edstripkits.com. Thanks a lot for watching. <music>